into our final spotlight on science this week. Here with more on his late breaking presentation on long term outcome following the Ross operation is Dr. Varun Shetty. The study is to uh, study the results and the long term outcomes of patients who underwent the Ross operation at our center in India. We've been doing the Ross operation for over 22 years and it was important to publish our results and the long-term outcomes of this operation. We specifically wanted to see how the patients were doing uh, in the long term, maybe 20 years after surgery, how many of them had re-operations, and what were the factors that were responsible for failure of the autograft in the long term. Quite simply, the Ross operation is done for patients who have aortic valve disease. We uh, take the pulmonary valve, which is also similar to a normal aortic valve, and implant it in the aortic position. And in the pulmonary position, we use a cadaver pulmonary valve. So the advantage of this over other operations is that the patient does not need to take Coumadin, and uh, they can have a more active lifestyle. And uh, in children, it's very useful because the, or the, the transplanted pulmonary valve has the ability to grow along with the patient which you don't see in prosthetic valves. We use the STS database to benchmark our results to see if our outcomes and results are comparable to what is in the United States. We were pleasantly surprised because uh, no such study has been done of this scale in, our, in India. And uh, we want to say that the, the in-hospital uh, mortality and the long-term survival was very good. For example, at 20 years, the survival was over 90% which is much more than patients who have a prosthetic valve in any part of the world. And the need for a re-operation, which is often the Achilles heel in the Ross procedure, was around 85% at 20 years. The Ross operation has a very important place in India because the average age of the Indian is around 29 years. And as you know, the most common heart condition there is, is bicuspid aortic valve. So if you were to factor in the prevalence, there are around 7 million Indians with bicuspid aortic valve disease. And uh, there is a general reluctance in the physician community to advocate for the Ross operation because they don't know about the results of the Ross operation in India. And we're hoping that studies like ours shows that it is a safe and a durable alternative to a mechanical valve for our Indian patients.